Welcome back to Watch ND Irish fans. I'm Jack Nolan. He's Irish head coach Mike Bray. This is our weekly exclusive weekend men's basketball preview. You've already won big games. You already played huge games. The game you play Saturday at Duke is the number one game in the country this weekend. It's the show, isn't it? We've been the feature and gosh, every game that's been hyped that we've been in has lived up to the billing. Certainly the last Duke game did, but this is a heck of a challenge for our team to go into Cameron Indoor Stadium. The tradition of the place, uh, the very, very difficult road atmosphere that it is, but I am really proud to take this team, this Notre Dame team into Cameron for the challenge. A lot, of course, has already been made that Coach K has played his former assistants in 21 yeah. games. He's 19 and two. You're the only guy to beat him. You know, he's competitive. They're a very good team. How hard is it to beat a team of this caliber twice, especially when you've already beaten them on your floor when you go to their floor? I think it's always hard, you know, to sweep somebody who's really good in the league. You know, we did it against Pittsburgh back in my early years and, you know, it's hard to do and uh, they'll be really ready to play. Uh, they probably didn't play as well as they wanted on Wednesday, so I feel we're going to get their best punch. The great thing about our game from 10 days ago is they're scoring. The ball goes in the bed. These are two talented offensive teams. I don't know if anyone's going to shut the other one down. Uh, you're going to have to score. For us to win, we've got to score that ball and be in our offensive rhythm. I know. I mentioned during the broadcast of the first Notre Dame Duke game, Two great teams, two well-coached teams who played great basketball. They then bounced back and hand Virginia, Virginia's first loss of the season. Then a little bit like you, although when you go up by 25, I don't think it's fair to say you struggled. Uh, you beat BC by eight. They only beat Georgia Tech by six in the game leading into this. A lot of similarities. Has Duke gotten better since you played them last? You know, I think we have because we had a couple days of practice on Monday and Tuesday, two days in a row to get some reps and stuff. And we weren't able to get two days in a row of hard practice because we just needed some rest the day after games. So I think we're better. I think they're better. And um, so uh, great matchup. Everybody watching. I'm really proud that our group gets to go into this venue and play in a big game. You know, and you're nice enough to let us look ahead to the next game just for this, because right now this team is focused on Saturday. But you do have a heck of a challenge, and it's one of those challenges that I think is almost anonymous to your fan base going in to play a very good Clemson team very quickly again on Tuesday. Well, Clemson is moving up the standings and putting themselves in position to be an NCAA tournament team from our league. Little John Coliseum, I've been there. No, not many Notre Dame people have been there. Very tough place to play. Uh, really good team. They guard the heck out of you. They grind you a little bit Virginia-like in pace and physically grinding you. The ride continues, folks, and it's been a wonderful ride so far, and I'm sure will continue to be. If you can't get to a TV for either of these games, you can always listen to them live right here on Watch ND. For Coach Bray, I'm Jack Nolan, Fighting Irish Digital Media.